Hey everybody, Ann here. Uh, I've just been piddling around doing this, that, and the other. But I have come to a very important decision about the meat rabbits. They're bunnies. They're pets. I can't kill them. I can't. And so I've got four pets that I just keep feeding. And, uh, you know, I have to clean up after them and all that kind of stuff. So I have found them a good home. And it's people who knows how to do the whole rabbit raising, chicken raising um, sort of thing. So they're going to come over a little bit later on today and pick the rabbits up. And, uh, yeah, I don't know what else I'm going to do. Uh, I think I need to split some wood. I might need to pull up some stuff in the garden. Um, I don't know, but I'm just relieved because... Those rabbits are just so pretty. They are just so cute. And I can't. I can't do it, but if somebody else can do it, that's great. I've opened up this little pen. Yeah, I think the bigger hens can still get in there, but I don't know if they will. So, yeah, a couple of them. And that's Zuma Zoom. There's Zuma Zoom. There you go, baby. So, yeah. I'm going to let them go out if they want to. Hopefully the biggers won't be mean. Look at how pretty they're getting. Uh-oh. Here comes Romeo. <laughs> yeah. We need to start letting them commiserate with one another. These are all doing really well over here. Look at Rocket 3. They're getting so big. That leghorn is the biggest out of all of the new baby chicks. Hello, lovely ladies. Look at that pretty barred rock. I don't know what the the hen was. I know it's uh, Rocky or Roman, who's the daddy, but I don't know what kind of hen it was. Definitely not a barred rock, but it, it's going to have some pretty coloring. And that had an Easter egg or mama. It's going to be interesting to see these grow. Uh-oh, here comes Hell on Wheels, Miss, Ro Miss Roxy. I hope she'll be nice to him. Yeah, definitely time for them to kind of get used to each other. They've been around each other because the hens in Romeo's been able to see them through this little fence here. Now you be nice, Roxy. Look how pretty they are. Yeah, I think all of these other ones are, are hens. Look at the beautiful coloring. My goodness. What are you eating? <laughs> That's not food. Yeah, you can eat that. Gosh, this pen is a mess. It smells. It's been raining, it's just been wet. So come on, two more to come out. Come on out, beautiful babies. They'll come out when they're ready. Beauty, she's just been sweet. She's almost like a, a mama hen. Don't prove me wrong. Yeah, there's Mama. <laughs> come on, there's one more that needs to come out. Come on. Well, it'll figure it out. I went ahead and took down their little yard because everybody's getting along really well. Yes, the big girls chase the little girls around, but um, yeah, and I just went ahead and pulled that uh, little shade up because they still need the shade and it still needs to be covered up top but they're all getting along really well I gotta clean their water buckets out um, it's just so wet in there but now there's a little bit more ventilation so yeah so I imagine they'll probably go up and roost in there and all the other chickens will go roost in there 
I'm just glad that they aren't, you know, totally afraid of one another and that they're getting along. And after all this rain, look at here. It's almost full. Yes. It's got quite a bit in there. I've uh, taken on quite a bit of that out and either used it on the garden or put it in the frog pond. You can tell it's pretty green. Uh, once I get this full all the way up, I'm going to treat it with bleach and then I'm going to either wrap it or spray paint it. I don't know if you can hear me, but this one is filled all the way to here. So that's a lot of water. This one is a little over half full. So that makes me happy. I've been working over here today, breaking the garden down. Uh, I've pulled every last bit of corn and the green bean plants. There's no green beans. They keep blooming and then the, the blooms just drop. I'm going to leave this squash plant. It's a patty pan squash. I've got no patty pan this year, so I don't know. I'll leave it there a little bit longer to see if it can do anything. Pull the squash plants out of here. There's two more zucchinis in here. I'm going to leave them just to see if I can get anything. But yeah, I'm going to just put that uh, the green beans down in there and let it mulch. I'm going to put some rabbit droppings over the top of it, kind of mix it up. Uh, so yeah, I pulled all of it, but over here, I have left these. I've made sure there's no more hornworms on them. That one's totally decimated, but if you remember, this one got totally eaten too, and it's coming back, so... I'm going to let these grow for a little while longer and just see if I can get anything. I have been harvesting off of these jalapeno pepper plants just about every day. The cayennes, well, I've picked a lot of cayennes off of them too. I've been picking them off green um, because they'll they'll turn red. Uh, but yeah, so yeah, I did definitely find some hornworms. Uh, horn worms on this one they love the pepper plants too but they're all gone now so i'll keep checking because there's a very good chance maybe there were some eggs laid or something i don't know but uh yeah so hopefully i'll still be able to get some some peppers still got some of this fencing left now selena mr lucas uh daughter-in-law came over and she brought me um some chicken wire that was kind of like twisted up. Well, I untwisted it and I got that whole side up high on the other side. So now I just need to, to get this one kind of raised up. Um, <laughs> this yard still looks terrible, but they're safe. Where are the baby chickens? There's a couple of them. Yeah, they're getting along pretty gosh darn good. Hi, beauty. What's up, pretty girl? Yep, there's a leghorn. Hi, mama. <laughs> she does like to chase him around a little bit. Look at her. I tell you what, I was working out here today and it got hot. It was supposed to be starting to cool down, but no, today it was really hot. That's why I got the air conditioning running. Papa's inside. I'm going to go inside in a minute. Um, the people who are going to pick up the rabbits, they haven't made, made it here yet. They may still make it yet today, but, uh, I'll save that for the next video. They had to build a, a little hutch and a yard for them. Um, so if they get here today, they get here. If they don't, they don't. I'm just looking around for more, uh, puffball mushrooms. I'm not seeing any. Anyhow, you know what? I think that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.